What's going on, everybody? Happy Monday. I know some people have today off, so your week will actually start tomorrow. Everybody else working. I've been playing around a little bit today, getting a little stuff done yard, running errands. But I want to get a couple videos done for this week, so we're going to start off this week with one of the most famous ones that we I get questions or talks about all the time. Where I talk about all the great unicorn colors of prism and select and all that other stuff. So what I did is I went through probably about, it's probably been about two weeks. And I've used like Cardboard Connection and a couple other places to count how many different types we had. Let me tell you, when you have multiple one-on-ones, wow, it just, it's crazy. Well, I'm going to pull this up just to show everybody here. There you guys go. So as we all know, Panini Prism started in 1213. Three variations, basically, of a card. Cool. 1314, and we go forward. Then right around, uh, that would have been Donovan Mitchell, Lonzo Ball, rookie year right there, Kuzma. I'm sure some other people just, it's not escaping me, Tatum. Uh, rookie year right here. It gets bumped up to 26. So we shoot forward to Luca's rookie year. We got 36 because we introduced Choice that year, which gave us, I want to say, another three or four colors there, and I forget what all they added to it. There might have been shimmers and sparkles and ices now. Then we moved forward to Zion's rookie year. We had 40. Lamelo, we're up to 45. My guess this year will be over 50. They're just killing the cards completely onto this. Um, back in 17, 18, I really thought 26 was a lot. And trust me, my numbers may be off here by one, two, maybe even three, because I was like making a little, you know, stick and then slash through for five, going through and making sure I caught them all. But there's a lot of parallels to this stuff. Imagine if I did Bowman. I don't even know if I could do Bowman because we got color or colored mojos and shimmers to waves to lavas. This was a headache. I mean, up until when we started hitting Zion's rookie year, I started going a little bit batty looking at stuff. Luca and Trey's rookie year, I started feeling, you know, the sweat dripping down going, my goodness, look how much we had here. But it's just crazy. So, real quick video today, just so you guys can see how much they started producing of this stuff. And if you really want to get bigger pictures onto it, go on to like Beckett and PSA and just search like, uh, take out the last part, put like 2012 Prism onto it. And look how many cards are graded and stuff like that there. It just gives you a bigger picture of how much had to be produced of this stuff. Because I want to say up until like... I know Luca's rookie year stuff started going up in price, but I know like 15, 16, 16, 17 stuff, we were, oh gosh, I think it was $25, $30 a box. It was cheap, cheap stuff across the board. Now, expensive because somebody labeled it the, the Bowman Chroma Panini type deal out there. All right, guys, let me know what you guys think. <clears throat> if my numbers are off and somebody asked something uh, a little bit better, let me know. I have no problem uh, going back checking or just taking your words <laughs> flat out for it, but this is me going through and counting every single one, then looking for the player variations, trying to figure out if they had, you know, like refractors, purples, purple ices, and all that stuff too. All right, guys. Let's see if I'm right. Over 50 this year. Over 50. All right. Have a good one. Catch y'all next video.